Dear Diary, Day, I don't keep track of it anymore. Why? Because I'm lonely. And the only thing I have to hold my hand are plants. And as we continue to terraformation this entire planet, the pressure is infinitely more than when it began. The heat from my extensive muscle overload is rising. My oxygen? Yeah, I can keep up with it. And the biomass so that I can have the pretty green stuff is going too slow. So today, I want to build Earth on Mars. Oh, what's up? A mother flowers. And as you guys can tell, we need more green because we need more oxygen and we need more water to make more green and more green to make more happy because money. So in an effort to do things, I think we're gonna build some more food growers. I think we're gonna need to build some more solar panels. And then we're also gonna need to build some more greenie boys, but also we wanna build the veggie tubes because we're gonna build a little bit of a walkway and these tier three veggie tubes give us lots of oxygen. Certainly not as much as the big beautiful biodome here, but we don't need five, six, seven, eight biodomes. We just need the one and it's gonna be glorious. So let's gather all the things and build them. Blam, blam, blam. Power blam, power blam, power blam. And we have power back, just barely, which isn't enough to do what we need to do. However, we are out of the aluminums, so we can't do anything. Boop, 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 boop. Now we must explore. All right, team, so there was a melty boo. There was a big message received. I can't work with you right now. I got things to do. There was a melty boy and we melted it, boy. Osmium. It's beautiful. Is this going to be an osmium cave? Please tell me yes to the dress because there's a lot of in-game material that are required for the osmium osmiums. I think we got more ice to melt, brothers. But give me the sulfur while I'm here. Melt at five. I don't know if that's a P or a U. It looks Russian. And I don't like it, because I want to rush on in. There was no loots on the edge, but I spy with my little eyes. Gold. Uh, yeah, I like it. Ooh, flowers. 600 power weapons. And a super alloy. Let's do it. What are you, spiky dude? Hello? Is there any, like, new loot here? Tidium? Everything's pretty normal here. I ain't gonna lie to you guys. It's all pretty. Di Ooh, <laughs> I lied. There's shipwrecks. Can I loot you? I want this, even though it's only an iron. But I. <gasps> we can do it. Mm, Gimme. Oh no! I don't have room in my inventory. What can I drop that is not of importance? And now we get the cobalt. Hel hello. Help. Can I? Please don't do this to me. Okay, thank you, thank you. Oh, uh, uh, yes. Our inventory is very full, so I'm thinking what we do, team, hear me out, is we go back out and around the way in which we came, and then we come back and loot things. You guys don't need to be here for the loot, but I'm sure there's lots of cool, th there's so many of these on the ground. I know, I just said that I was gonna leave you guys, but that little area is like right here, and our house is on the other side of these little rocky dudes. It's beautiful, it's golden, and now we have a shortcut. As I was traveling back and forth from the solar panel graveyard to our base, I found a thing, and it's golden. And what do you got for me? Super, <gasps> we got a golden effigy of the space base that we came in on. I like it, it's beautiful. Moving on, there's a space wreck. I don't remember seeing this before. Is this new? Is it not new? All I know is it's got loot. Whoa, we just clipped into that. Can we do that again? Oh, they got chests for days. Let me in. Let me in. Oh, 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 we gotta get loots, brothers. What do you got for me? Loots for days. Oh my lord. I'll be back for you. We got chips for days, brothers. Now what do you got for me? Mining speed, again, I haven't used it at all. I don't know if it's even gonna be benefit at all. Maybe when we get to the more complex stuff, we'll need it to mine faster, but I don't know. More chips, jetpack, D2. We're living the dream. 
A GPS satellite? I don't... Have we even gotten the first one yet? I don't know. Big living compartments. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? What are you? Where are you at? Oh my gosh. What? Bigger living compartment. Three iron. Okay. We're going to do this. I want to see what it looks like. The fact that this takes three iron, three titium, and two super alloys means it's very expensive. What do I connect it to? And how do you snippity snap? Is there a special weight? We're <laughs> it's going to be hideous. But we're going to snap it there just so I can get into it without having to add a door. Because I don't want to get more components. Because we're not going to keep it. Unless it's very nice. In which case, we keep it. But I can see it on the other end. It's beautiful. <gasps> it doesn't have the poles in the middle. It doesn't have the little dividers. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. I want this everywhere. We may have a potential base redesigning once we progress further in this game. I don't know. But it's beautiful. And I need it in my life. Look at the space! Look at how much inventory we have! I think it's the same... I think we have the same inventory as a full container! We are loaded to the moon! I totally forgot we were supposed to do the biolab today! But we have osmium, so let's do it! I'm thinking we do a little bit of a redesign because I like this space here being an entry port. And if we put a little hut here, it's just gonna link them. So unfortunately, goodbye corner and goodbye. Maybe we keep the second corner. I, nah, I think we gotta get rid of it. I don't think we're gonna have space. And now we add the bio lab. How do you work? Where do you link? I saw you trying to link before. Linky dink. <laughs> Our power is destroyed. Our solar panel area keeps growing quite intensively. We may have to relocate. I don't know. We'll figure that out when we get there. But we have enough to continue. And now we can go look at the lab. What are you? And how do you exist in this world? Actually, I really like the idea of having this over here. I think this is great. And then we can essentially... We'll just change how we have these labs going. The food labs. I think what we'll do is we'll have them go around this outside and then this inside will be an open way for maybe a chesticles i don't know but what do you do and why are you rotated this way is this good no actually yes this is good because computer Ooh, bacteria sample bioplastic nuggets so we can make those now that's kind of good uh fertilizer we don't know how to make the algae so i guess we'll have to figure that one out later more algae methane cartridge we need cows we can do this though we have sulfur and we have iridium so i'm guessing this explosive powder is going to be our next mission so i came to an idea a thunk if you might wish grass spreaders and veggie tubes we probably should produce as many of those as we can so how many lirmas do we have one two three four five so let's try to build five grass spreaders. Grass blab, grass blab, grass blab, grass blab. Big green death machine blab. And we have power. We don't have much headway, but we got power because the big green death machine says we have power. It produces 86 coopers, which is huge, which is way more than these that are like 20. So I have a feeling that eventually we'll get rid of all the solar panels, make them exclusively aesthetic, and then go all the way to the nookie nukes however these are easier to get their hands on so maybe we'll just still expand this and i don't know i still like the big nasty death lasers i think they're fun but we are going to need more of them because our pressure is although building quickly is not building quickly enough to progress big green death machine blab green worship the great and holy green i don't know if there's going to be osmium here but i found this really cool little hidey hole it looks like it might be a cave entrance of some kind. It's got like that, that Roman like pillars. I think it looks cool. Osmium. Osmium. Os <gasps> Are you? Oh, you're just regular chest. Okay, 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 okay. Super alloys. There's super alloys ever. I never for a second thought that our biggest concern was gonna be osmium. I thought super alloy. Is this a super alloy cave? Because we're actually pretty full on super alloys, so. I don't want to get caught up in like 
looting that. Whoa. Whoa. What is this? This is definitely man-made. Oh my goodness. Now, it could just be a cool little design for the end of the world, or it could be something that's going to have lore in the future. I don't know. Maybe we can unlock it when we build Earth. Oh my gosh, that's super cool. What do you got? Uh, we don't need water. We do want these rare materials, though. Is it just a little super alloy cave? I think that's all this was. That's nifty. That's really cool, actually. No osmium. But that's a cool discovery. And we're gonna wanna go back to that. And we did it! And not to mention that we did it, but we do have a decent amount of osmium. At least in comparison to what we used to have. So we got four of them, which means we can make more minor dues. I wanna figure out if this matters where it's placed. And we're back in the cave. And I wanna know if I build this here. Does it not go on those? Does it not go in the cave at all? Oh, wait, 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 wait. We can place it here. What do you do? It's got a little chest on it. How do I tell what it makes? Heat, pressure. Ow. It's only making iron here? There's gotta be a better place. I will research. And we found a spot for our miner to go. Now, unfortunately, I did, oh, okay, I, I shouldn't say unfortunate. I did a lot of research and unfortunately, it looks like you can't get osmium from the miner because uh, allegedly there's a Mark II miner. I don't know. It doesn't say Mark I, Mark II. Maybe there's a difference, but we'll figure it out. However, we will be getting aluminum. So aluminum will no longer be a problem for us at all, ever. And we're producing heat and the pressure. Look, 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 heat and pressure. Heat is actually doing pretty good, and the pressure is actually doing pretty good. So, that's good. That's good, that's good, that's good. I found it. There is an ore extractor T2, and this is where we can automate super alloys and, uh, and osmium. But the final mission today is I want to at least build the launch platform so we can look fancy. Rocket pad. And our power's dead. But we have a launch pad. And my thought process, all right, hear me out, hear me out. My thought process is because it won't snap to this stuff, which annoys me, is we build it off in the distance. So it's a little bit away from our comfort space. And how do you work? I think we just, can we flat? No, oh, we gotta click. Clam. And then we launch. <laughs> There's nothing to launch. What about me? Launch me. All right. Ooh. Asteroid attraction racket. Attraction uranium asteroids give a global heat generation bonus. A heat multiplier of a thousand percent? Pressure multiplier a thousand percent? Oh my gosh, I think we're gonna launch a handful of these in the next one because the pressure one is gonna be huge. Iridium asteroid is not a big deal for us, but global generation bonus by protecting the magnetic pressure. That's great and that's easy. And we can build that so fast. But that, my friends, is for another episode because we've gone on for far too long. We've done a lot of exploring. We got a mine that automates aluminum and it's just, it's right there. It's right there. We can see it, barely see it, but it's seeable. Unlimited aluminum. And then when we get to tier two, we'll have unlimited osmium because we know where the cave is and super alloy because there's a super alloy cave over there. So we're going to have like all the in-game stuff automated is going to be so good. And these beautiful death green blaps will carry us to success. I feel like we've accomplished quite a lot today, but this my friends, is the one I'm most proud of. It looks green and lush and beautiful. And we have a great front yard where we have flowers leading up to our base. It's so cool. And we got the miner and everything, but it is what it is. Remember, like and comment, subscribe, and great tools for you to get in touch with me. Let me know if you like, didn't like, and what you want to see next. In the next episode, we're going to launch some rockets and uh, hopefully progress. <laughs> because that's what you do in games like this. But remember, like, and comment, subscribe, and great tools for you to get in touch with me. Let me know what you like, didn't like, and what you want to see next. If I repeated that, oh well, I forgive myself. But I'm going to shut my filthy little cake hole. But before I do, remember, I love you guys, and we will see you next time. Toodles.